What's going on YouTube and welcome back. Today we're going to be taking a look at this guy right here. The Axis Micro Mini from Focusworks EDC. Uh, picked this up in copper, machine finished. Uh, machine finished with a machine finish. Um, unfortunately, I feel like I say this a lot, but copper is sold out. Uh, you still can pick it up in stainless steel, bronze, or brass. I believe you can get them either machine finished or stone washed. Um, I believe most of those are still available. Um, let's go over the specs on this guy. Uh, so it's fairly small. The caps are 18 millimeters. Uh, stainless steel. I actually flame these guys. Uh, not the best lighting, you can't really see the color all that well. But it's actually a nice blurple with like that bronzy color on top. Looks pretty good. I was not disappointed. Uh, press fit. So we'll take these caps off and have a look underneath. Uh, and that is an SBV2. Um, they used to ship with a ceramic. Uh, bearing and I believe heck over at flavor zone essentials uh, Got together with focus works and now they're doing the whole bearing thing with them. So that's nice to see Everybody likes their FZ essentials um, And like I said, I got the machine finish and I don't know if you're really gonna be able to pick that up on camera But it is really nice Um it's exactly like the bigger one. The detail, like the little ribbing in the inside there. Everything is just really nice. Um, and when I got the large one, I was, the machine finish was a little hot for me. I had to like polish it down a little bit. Um, but with this, you don't feel it at all. I'm actually really happy I went with the machine finish and not the stone wash. Um, just looks really nice. Good job. Good job. Um, where was I? Uh, tungsten balls. Tungsten carbide balls. Um, not really sure what that means, really. Tungsten, tungsten carbide. I'm not really sure if there's a difference or if it's just a different way of saying it. Uh, I'm not really a tungsten guy. It comes in at 42 grams. And I was always saying my scale's a little bit off, but it's really not off as much as I thought it was because the website says it's 42 grams and actually you can actually see that for once and it says 42.3 so it's not that far off my scales not as sketchy as I thought which is actually nice to see um, has a 44 millimeter spin diameter and is roughly 11 millimeters thick probably something like 11.5 millimeters um, but yeah, finish on this guy, like I was saying, is absolutely incredible. For something so small, for it to be so detailed is actually really, really nice. Uh, good job on that, Jordy. <clears throat> uh, feel in hand, um, it's actually really, really fidgetable. I was concerned when I first got it that it was going to be too small, but you're able to just get really nice pulls, really nice flicks. Um, dare I say it might be more fidgetable than its bigger brother. Gyroscopic effect on this guy. Really nice for something so small. Um, it's actually quite surprising. Probably because the balls are tungsten and the weight's mostly towards the outside of the spinner. But very nice. I'm really enjoying this guy. Like I said, I really was concerned that I was going to be too small. And even when I got it, I was like, oh, wow. This is really tiny, but you don't really feel it. Um, I do kind of find sometimes you have to like do more of a pinch grip on it and it can get like a little cramp in here, but if you like make a conscious, uh, conscious effort, why did that not come out right? Conscious effort, there we go, uh, to really like get a flatter grip, you don't really get that cramp in your hand or tightness or whatever you want to call it. Uh, really enjoying it. Really, really good for fidgeting. We like that. Um, very similar to the 
uh, where is it? Busy Mind Cortex Nano, I believe it is. That pull from the side is really nice. Um, <clears throat> don't know if I have much else to say about this guy. Uh, it's it's just really nice. I was pleasantly surprised. Um, I don't know if I mentioned the price, but you can pick them up from $55 to $60. I think for the machine finish, it's $55, and stone wash is $60, but I could be wrong. It could be the other way around. Um, they're actually on sale. They're on sale. You get a $5 discount. I believe they're normally 60 and 65 something like that. So check it out. Focus works. Um, I believe I heard that uh, Jordy will not be making any more of these. I'm not 100% sure. Don't quote me on that, but I'm pretty sure I read that in a post somewhere, uh, which would be a shame. Um, I guess the demand just isn't as high for them as they once were. Not even that, I feel like everybody that wanted one probably now they've been around for so long and Jordy fixed that whole situation over there with Last Room Standing. So everybody that probably wanted one probably got one and there's only so many variants of an Access Micro you can do, right? So uh, not necessarily a bad thing. Doesn't mean you'll never ever see it again. So yeah we're really liking it it's like a one for one uh, I don't think they made the smaller one of this guy it and copper I could be wrong but I don't think I'd want it I'm not to be not hating or anything like that I just I don't feel there was a need for me personally to have like the whole set I guess you could call it <laughs> I have the uh blue aluminum one this one and this guy now so i'm good with that um excellent work jordy once again uh there's not much really else to say pleasantly surprised one unicorn fart and uh yeah that's pretty much it um uh, might be doing a little first look on this guy but not sure yet it's, uh, yeah that's it that's all till next time live long and spin on peace that was a short video 8 minutes and 8 seconds